to Roberto Duran, Hands of Stone. Hands of Stone, Roberto Duran. Now listen, you could choose which division, that's how great he is. He was a champion at lightweight, welterweight, junior middleweight, and I believe middleweight. He fought Kennedy Canada at 135. He was a fucking monster. He, he, was a, he was a beast all the way up to welterweight. Yeah. I mean, insane. He's only five foot five. I'm going to say five foot six. He was able to go from 135 pounds all the way to light heavyweight. Roberto, Roberto is a legend, you know, so quite naturally, I can figure, I got to take my hat off to the man. He's a good man. Roberto Duran personifies the perfect boxer. He has the most important characteristics that spell success, not only in boxing, but in any field of endeavor. Mental energy, self-control, determination, plus a lot of ability. This is a guy who, when I pick Duran, I'm going to say the lightweight Duran, one of the greatest lightweights of all time. I think he went like 50 fights without a loss. He was an intimidator that we hadn't seen since Sonny Liston, the great heavyweight, who was one of the great intimidators of all time. I mean, he looked at you with those dark, hollow, cold, hollow eyes. And he looked right through you. And sometimes that was just enough. You know, when I first saw Ali, I said, yeah, that's who I wanted to be. Like, I know I wanted to be a fighter, but then I saw Roberto Duran. I said, that's who the fuck I want to be. I said, that's who I want to be. I mean, motherfuckers, people scared to look at him. The devil. with a fury square off tomorrow night in montreal for the wbc welterweight title the bout is probably the most anticipated non-heavyweight fight since another sugar ray robinson that is fought randy turpin and carmen basilio back in the 50s i think he made order for sugar ray i think duran because his, his style he walks in you know quite on the other fellow served fast he's such a great boxer Basically, I will box Duran because he cannot beat me in any way but to bring the fight to me. He's gone in the seventh round. 
Kobayashi face down on the canvas here. Better great big group. 